Hey y'all, what's up? It's Molly. Welcome back to another video. The fact that I'm even saying that right now is so surreal to me. I kind of just decided very spur of the moment to sit down and film and film a little life update video for you guys and just kind of talk about where I've been. It's been a few months since I've uploaded a video, which I've been doing YouTube since I was a senior in high school. I'm a junior finishing out my junior year at the University of Alabama right now. And since I started YouTube, I really haven't taken a break. And so it was very unlike me to do that, but I kind of just wanted to sit down, explain a little bit about that, and also talk to you guys about what I've been up to for a little bit. This video might be two minutes long, it might be 10 minutes long, but regardless, I really just wanted to let you guys know where I've been, what I've been up to, and hopefully start filming a little bit more for you guys, which we'll kind of get into how that's gonna work. But, so if you are new here and don't know me, my name is Molly. I am a junior at the University of Alabama, like I said. I'm a public relations major here. I'm also a Pi Beta Phi here, and I am just so excited and grateful that you clicked on this video today to hear me kind of talk a little bit about my life and what's been going on. Um, so yeah, that's my little <laughs> intro spiel. So without further ado, let's just jump right into it. So basically I have not uploaded since right after Christmas. So it has been almost two months and let me tell you, it has been the weirdest two months of my life just because I have become so used to my YouTube schedule and it's become such a passion for me and it's been so weird not being able to talk to you guys basically every day filming what I'm doing at school and different things going on and it's just been really weird transitioning kind of figuring out what else I want to do in my life to kind of fill that passion because the reason I haven't been on YouTube is not because I don't want to do it anymore or because I'm burnt out because that is the furthest thing from the truth. I actually broke my camera, sort of. It was very, very odd. I was filming a national championship vlog, like coming back to school and doing the whole natty celebrations. Um, and basically what happened was I put my camera in the cup holder of my car and for some reason ever since I put it in the cup holder my viewfinder has not worked so I'm currently filming on a broken camera I have no idea what I look like right now I just really wanted to put something on YouTube because I've missed it so much um and until I can get a new camera I am working with this right now and so if I am uploading on YouTube going forward it will be limited until I can get a camera that is fully functioning once I get a fully functioning camera I will be back full-time uploading twice a week like I have done for the past few years um but that's kind of been the situation i did not have warranty on my camera so that was a little tough for me to deal with because i had no way to really get it fixed because you have to have the warranty to get it fixed which i do not have so that's where we're at with all of that um and that's why i haven't been able to upload really at all for the past two months um and so i've been trying to be a little more active on tiktok and instagram and that's been going well um but i think the main things that i feel like i've been doing have been a lot more personal like habit changes and really just focusing on being very healthy with my mindset with my physical health with my mental health I've been creating a lot of really amazing habits and honestly once I start filming more regularly again I can talk a little bit about all of those habits and kind of what made me do this change but I've been working out every day I've been eating much healthier I've been teaching myself to cook a little bit slowly but surely I'm a terrible cook so I'm starting with the bare minimum but I've just been doing a lot of things like that that have really made my life here and my lifestyle here a lot more feeling like an adult and feeling a lot more independent, which is something I think I struggled with for a really long time. I was very dependent on my parents and my friends and people around me um, to do things for me. And I'm trying to just feel stronger in myself, both in my mind and physically. Um, and it's been going really well. It's become like a really good outlet for me, especially in a time when I didn't have YouTube. It's been really meaningful. And I also, as you guys know, I'm a huge reader. That has not changed. I am just really focusing on dedicating time to myself outside of schoolwork and extracurriculars and caption agency work and just giving myself time in my day to really sit down, read, relax, work out, eat well, just doing all of those things, which has been really, really incredible. And once I get back into filming more regularly, I can totally do what I eat in a day, workout routines, focusing more on those healthier aspects of my life because I think it's been a really important change for me and it's been something that I've really loved growing in that way i guess um so i'd love to share that with you guys if you guys are interested but besides that i've been here i it is currently filming this on february 28th um i'm my second semester of my junior year 
Um, and I've been doing a million different things, both with school, clubs, all of the things. But I think my biggest things that I've been involved in, especially Capstone Agency, I was recently um, promoted to be editorial director of the agency. So I'm doing a lot of editing um, of different writing materials for the agency, which has been incredible. And being in a leadership position in the agency now is just like something I've always imagined myself doing. And so it's just really cool to hear or to do that finally after years of kind of just being like, I want that to be me one day. Um, so that's been really amazing. Um, as you guys know, I'm also involved in Her Campus, which is a online publication for millennials and Gen Z focused audiences. Um, and I was recently promoted to be senior editor for that. So I'll be doing that for the next year. And I'm super, super excited about that because her campus connects to so many incredible companies and brands and just amazing people. And the organization specifically here has some amazing people in it as well. So that's going to be really amazing. And your girl got her first big girl internship for the summer. I found out about two weeks ago and I could not be more excited. It is going to be so amazing. Just getting a real world work big girl experience i'm so excited and i feel like my hard work really came to fruition when i found out i got it i was just so overwhelmed and just proud of myself because i'm a very introverted person it takes a lot for me to get on an interview with someone and have to brag about myself in a way and so doing that was crazy it felt a little weird but i did it i did it three times for the internship three times and I got the internship which is really really amazing so over the summer when I'm filming um, I'll probably talk a little bit more about that and get into details about it but I'm really excited about that and that's something I've been really really proud of but yeah those are just some updates for you guys I really just wanted to give you guys a really quick lowdown of what's been going on with me and just tell you guys how much I miss you and how grateful I am I've been getting DMs about people asking me when I'm coming back to YouTube and just like knowing y'all miss me and want to see my videos again really means a lot so so like I said, I will be trying hopefully soon to be getting a new camera and to be getting back into regular filming. Um, but until then, the videos are going to be a little bit more sparse. But once I get a new camera that is fully working, um, we'll be back to the full uploads. Um, so I'd love to hear what you guys want to see from me going forward. Um, I can do the vlogs again. I know you guys love seeing just like the daily life of Pi Fi. I also really, really want to do a video with my grand little Laurel and Allison and do a Q&A like Allison and I did a while ago. So if you guys want to see that, please comment down below if you want to see that, if you have any other ideas for me because I miss YouTube. I think the time honestly away from YouTube was so important for me because I think it helped me round out and like really improve upon some other areas in my life that I think might have been lacking, like my physical and mental health. And I think now that I've spent so much time focused on that, I'm really able to like fully be myself in front of the camera and feel like feel confident in the person I am and the habits I have and like sharing myself with the world because I feel like I've just grown as a human in such a short amount of time I've really only been away from y'all for like two months but I think there's been a lot of growth and change in there and again like especially with mental health I don't want anyone to think that I'm just preaching saying like the second you start doing these things you're gonna feel so much better and you're never gonna have hard days because I still have hard days I still have days where I'm very anxious and just want to stay in bed or maybe don't want to be as productive as I am other days and that's completely normal it is not a, like a straight shot uphill climb there are ebbs and flows but I think that the things that I've done for myself in the time that I've been away have been really important in my growth as a person. I mean, I, in a million years, never really thought I would put myself out there to apply for like an internship with like a corporate company. And I did, and it worked out, and it was really meaningful to me. So I think it's just really helped me grow as a human a lot in a lot of ways. But yes, please let me know what you guys wanna see from me coming up. I miss you guys, I love you guys. Thank you for being patient with me. And I just couldn't be more excited to get back into showing you guys my life here and everything that I've been up to. So. Hope you guys enjoyed this little update. I will see you soon. I'm going to start filming again. I'm so excited to be back into YouTube, but I just wanted to let you guys know what I've been doing. Love you guys. Thank you. Subscribe down below if you're new. Follow me on my social media. My other social medias, they are linked in the description because I post on there when I'm not posting on YouTube. So I just want you guys to know that. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time.